Hi and welcome to Outwell and to the Laguna Coast from our Smart Air awning collection. As you can see here, this is a compact porch awning designed for caravans between 2.4 metres high and 2.55 metres high. The overall size is 2.6 metres wide and it's 2 metres deep. So that still gives you a good amount of space on the inside, which we will show you shortly. Firstly, though, I just want to talk you through the, uh, the setup and the uh, construction of this awning. So we're actually using an inflatable beam across the front here in place of your traditional steel or fiberglass framed. Now, what this has is actually the valve at the bottom here. We have two separate valves. So you can see here there's an air in valve just here, which is where you would plug the pump in. So this just unscrews. You plug the pump in here and start pumping that up. And obviously, with it being just the one beam, very quick and easy to inflate. To deflate is also very simple. You can see here that we have an air out valve. And just under here is where the valve is. So again, taking the awning down, it's really simple. You just need to open this valve up. The air will come out of this beam here, allowing you, as I say, for quick and easy uh, deflation. Now, we do supply the pump with the awning. And it's just like this one here, which is a double action hand pump. So every time you pull up and push down, you will actually be inflating the beam. You can keep an eye on the pressure as well because we have this uh, pressure gauge on top here. And what we would recommend would be to inflate this between 8.7 and 11.6 PSI, which represents 0.6 to 0.8 bar. So there is actually a lot of pressure going into this beam. Obviously, the more air we can get in there and the higher the pressure within here, the more solid that beam is going to be. And obviously, the more stable it is as well. So you'll notice that when you're setting your awning up that you actually get three different types of peg with the awning. So this is our easy pegging system. What you will find is we supply you with four solid steel anchor pegs and these are for the corners of the awning and that would go through the grey pegging points. We then have black plastic pegs for all of the black pegging points and we have the luminous pegs here for the luminous storm straps at the front. So it's all in the name there, the easy pegging system, making sure that it's nice and easy for you to get the right peg in the right place. So in terms of construction, I'll start off on the, uh, the fly sheet on here. So what we have is a 150 denier material all the way around the sides. And that is the material that you can see the logo embossed on here. We then have a 300 denier material for the roof. And both of the materials are actually taffeta polyester. So very good quality material. And what you will find is that the entire awning has been PU coated on the inside and then all of the seams have been fully taped all the way around as well to ensure that it is completely waterproof. So it has a hydrostatic head of 6,000 millimetres, which is why we call this our Outex 6000 material. Plenty of other features around the awning as well. We have large windows all the way around here, allowing lots of light onto the inside. But these windows are tinted, so that serves two key functions. One is to reflect a little bit of the sunlight away from the inside keeping you a little bit more comfortable. And the second is obviously just to give you that little bit more privacy within the awning as well. You can see here that we have good uh, quality storm uh, guy lines at the front here just to keep the awning in a good and stable uh, condition in bad weather. We also then have some mud flaps which are around the side here, just allowing any water to run down and away from the inside of the awning. So coming around to the front door, uh, I just want to highlight that you can see quite clearly here that we have rolled away the main outside door. You can see here as well another large tinted window. Again, this also has curtains on the back of it as well, which we'll show you on the inside. But a really nice feature here is that we then have a secondary door which sits behind the main door on the outside. And this is a full mesh panelled door. So you can just see here that we have a large mesh panel on this side. And if we were to unroll this out to the front, there is also another large mesh panel which would cover this area here. So obviously what that's going to allow is lots of cool fresh air into the awning if it is a hot day. But if there are a lot of bugs floating around, then this is hopefully going to keep them out. Stepping into the awning itself, it is a good size. Whilst it's a compact uh, style porch awning, there's still a good enough size to have a couple of pieces of furniture or perhaps storage units and things like that as well. So if I just move this chair out of the way, I'll show you some details on the side here. The awning does have two side entrances, and on either one of those, you'll also find that there's a full zipped mesh door here. So again, the same sort of purpose as the front door, allowing 
lots of cool fresh air into the awning but hopefully keeping out those unwanted bugs as well again on the outside we have the main waterproof door zipped away which of course you can close over as well so as I mentioned, the awning has lots of windows all the way around here and they are tinted, so you do get good privacy. But if you want more privacy, then they each have zip up curtains. So you can just see here that you have the zips either side. And what that allows you to do is just choose exactly how much uh, privacy you're getting or how much light you're letting into the awning itself. Just at the back here, I just want to highlight that we have these steel poles which come with the awning as well, which just create a good uh, attachment point to the caravan. Now, the sleeve behind the pole here is actually quite thickly padded obviously to ensure that this steel pole isn't going to rattle against the caravan in bad weather you can see it's secured in place with these velcro straps um, along the sleeve here as well and there is also an adjustable point at the bottom here because as i mentioned this awning is suitable for caravans of a varying different sort of size or height the ground sheet that comes with the awning is actually a fully sealed ground sheet from side to side and it's bathtub in style as well so it comes up at the edges so that's going to stop any drafts from coming in it's going to hopefully keep out things like dirt and dust and sand and things like this because you can see here it comes up at the side and it's also hopefully going to keep out unwanted bugs if however you're at a caravan site that doesn't allow you to have a waterproof or sealed ground sheet that's not an issue because if i just pull back the carpet here you'll see that there's a zip that runs all the way along, along here so this entire ground sheet can be zipped out if you are on a campsite that doesn't allow waterproof ground sheets so you can see at the back of the awning and at the bottom of the caravan you do have this skirt which is also included with the awning just to stop any drafts from coming into the awning itself we then have a lantern hanging point at the top in a good central location here and then running away from that we actually have cable tidies which run all the way down here so that if it is an electrical lantern that you're using you can keep the cables nice and tidily stowed away so we have a couple of optional extras available for the awning which would include a fleece carpet like you can see here just giving you a bit more comfort underfoot we also offer a footprint for the awning as well which is actually made of a very tough and durable material which is a PVC coated tarpaulin. Now that's going to come in really handy if you're on a hard standing pitch perhaps with uh, chips or stones. Um, that's going to protect this ground sheet uh, on that sort of surface but also if you are on a grass uh, pitch then it will keep this ground sheet clean and dry as well. So there you have it, that's all the features of our Laguna Coast from our Smart Air awning collection. Thank you very much for watching.